frustration and finger pointing. Do drop in manager Autumn Dowling says this was the scene as she tried to explain the restaurant's mask policy to an angry customer Saturday. I had asked him to put on a mask when he was going to the restroom and he became irate. When he refused, Dowling says she asked his table to leave, which only escalated the already tense situation. Then he got in my face and was cursing at me. Eventually, more employees stepped in, calling police as well to help mediate. I mean, it ain't something that we deal with every day, but uh, we deal with enough with it that it, it's kind of a problem. The do drop in just received five star certification on Friday after submitting an extensive COVID-19 safety plan. It includes hourly sanitation, temperature checks, a contact tracing log and mask wearing as much as possible. It's not that that we want to, you know, make people do these things. It's like that we have to follow in order to stay open. This five star sticker doesn't grant the do drop in increased capacity right now, but Dowling says it will allow them to stay open if restaurants are ordered to close their doors once again. They're not just coming up with these rules and regulations on their own. These are mandates that's come down from the health department. Pueblo Police Sergeant Frank Ortega encourages restaurants and bars to resolve COVID-19 related disputes on their own. If that doesn't work, he says it is okay to call police. In this case, they were uh, issued a harassment, municipal harassment charge. Uh, they obviously need to go to court and make a determination if the judge convicts them on that charge, but they were cited for harassment. At least three dozen restaurants and bars in Pueblo have received five star certification so far. Reporting live in Pueblo, Lauren Barnes, KRDO News Channel 13.